Hey everybody, welcome back to RC with Adam. My name is Adam, so good to be back here with you. We've got another Fly Sky Basics video. Today we're going to be talking about uh, the FSI6X, and this will also work with the i6, and how to reverse the channels, the servo channels. In this case, we're looking at an airplane, but this, this would also work for like a quadcopter, although usually if you need to reverse something on a quadcopter, you're going to use Betaflight. Anyway, so you might end up with a situation where your servo that controls the control surface, in this case the elevator, is backwards. And so in this case, I, when I push up on the elevator stick, the actual elevator should go down, which is gonna cause the plane to point the nose down. So right now it's actually backwards. So what I need to do is I need to go into my transmitter and reverse it because what I could do is physically move the servo to a different, like basically turn the servo around, but it's glued in place and I don't wanna do that. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go into my transmitter and reverse that channel. In this case, it's gonna be channel two. So here we are in the transmitter, just the main screen. We're gonna press and hold okay to go into the menu. And then we're gonna to go to the function setup. And then the very first option is reverse and we wanna select that. And then here we have all of our channels and so we can scroll through the channels by pressing okay. And in this case, we want to select channel two, which is our uh, elevator channel right here. And so we're just gonna use the up or down arrow to change it from normal to reverse. So what that's gonna do is actually change the direction that this is going. So this is actually going in the correct direction now that we reversed it. So watch what happens if I hold this down and then I press, if I was gonna press reverse, well, bam, look at that. And then it goes the opposite direction because it's you know sending it a reverse signal. So now it's going the correct way and we didn't have to swap around any servos, which is great. Then what you wanna do is you want to press and hold cancel, which is weird, I know, uh, to, make, to save it. And then you go back in here and it will be saved. Now, keep in mind, this is just a good you know safety tip thing right here. You wanna take off your propeller whenever you're reversing channels, just in case you accidentally reverse channel three, which is the standard throttle channel, because if you reverse it, that's gonna happen and your motor is going to turn on because your transmitter or your receiver thinks that this throttle down position is full throttle. Well, there you go, folks. I hope this was helpful. If it was, leave me a comment. Or if you have any questions about this stuff, leave me a comment and I or maybe someone else will be able to help you. Thank you so much for watching and subscribing. I really do appreciate it. And if you haven't subscribed already, uh, consider subscribing if you like what you see and you want to see more. And especially if you fly Fly Sky, because that's what I have a lot of on this channel. Anyway, thanks for watching, everybody, and I'll see you again very soon.